Okay guys, I have a very special box here. I have been admiring the Ello and Wild dolls for quite a while, but they're a bit out of my price range normally. Um, so I've been looking for one that didn't come with an outfit that was used. Um, sort of how I like to get my used Takara dolls. I don't usually go for, um, I don't go for one with all of its stock because I don't like to spend more than $150 on anything used. Um, and I was able to find one and I got a Cyber Monday deal on her. So she was under $150. What's funny though, is the seller was selling her, her stock outfit separately. And had she not done that, I would not have been able to afford this doll at this moment. So I'm going to open her up and we will see what I got. Okay, so I have the box opened and the doll that I bought here um, is the Elowin Overdressed question mark. That's the name of the doll and she comes nude and she has a couple small stains. Uh, I think they were like on her feet from her socks or her boots or something. So I got this doll off of eBay. Oh my gosh, I'm really hoping I like her. I don't know until I um, actually have a doll in my hand sometimes if I'm really gonna like them or not. And I'm hoping I will. She's so much bigger than I thought she was gonna be. I mean, I knew she was a big girl, but I'm always surprised by any dolls that are bigger than Barbies. <laughs> So let's see, she's wrapped in lots of bubble wrap. Oh my goodness. I have been drooling over Ellen Wilds on Tammy, uh, Tammy's channel, Tammy from Pieced Craft Dolls with Tammy Pally. Oh my gosh, look at her. All right, let's see. I'm gonna throw my, my wrap down so we can put her down and see. Oh, sorry, I'm making you guys sick. All right. Wow, she's super pretty. She's so much bigger than I thought she was going to be. Let's, I'm taking a look at her limbs. Here she has um, Ello and Wild tag on her. Uh, I believe this doll, uh, Tammy helped me ID her. She, I think she's a 2007 release. Ooh, her... Um, Knees are still really tight, or pretty tight. This leg is nice and tight. She really hasn't been messed with much. Um, you can see her manicure here. Now, the funny thing is, I love the raven hair on her. She has t painted toenails, and see, she's got a little bit of staining on her legs here. Um, she has this very elaborate hairdo, which I really kind of want to take down. I don't know if that's going to make the doll, like, um, I don't know if that's going to affect the doll or not. I just, it's nice that her hair is up, but, um, you know me, I like to brush my doll's hair and stuff, so it does need a good brushing. Here's her face. She's absolutely gorgeous. Look at her. Um, the dress that she was in really was like a very f formal, um, like an event dress, not like an everyday outfit. Look how pretty. She's got some product still in her hair here. Um, God, she's really... She's really, how big is she? Anyway, I don't really even know how big these dolls are. Let's see. I need to get a stand for her. She's, is she bigger than my jean dolls? Let's see, I'm gonna measure her for you guys. She is, she's like 17 inches. So a 16 inch doll, 17 inch doll. This leg is a little looser than this one. So she definitely needs a stand. Uh, I like how they can sit without their legs spreading open like crazy. Um, so yeah, she either needs a, she needs a stand or she's going to have to be seated. Oh my goodness. 
her hair is amazing. I really want to take it down. Let me know in the comments below if you would take her hair down or leave it up. Like I'm worried. Well, I don't really care about the resale necessarily, but if I take it down and that hairstyle is gone, does that mean she's no longer like worth um, what she is or because I just don't like their hair. I'm not like a leave that doll in a display quality, you know, I like to mess with it and like hair brushing is very soothing to me with my dolls. So I really like their, even if I put it in a braid or something or pull it up in a ponytail, I like to take it down and brush it. And like, that's part of the reason I like dolls. Um, and it looks like it would be really long. I just don't know what would happen if I take it down. Um, it looks like it, I mean, look at, it's got this French twist in the back, then it's got braids. Um, but yes, um, vote in the comments below. God, she's so pretty. I love her dark looks. Um, overdressed. Yeah. So let me know. I'm really happy with her. She's like, I need to download, I need to buy some, a pattern or get a pattern for her to make her something. Uh, so she's not naked. And um, what do you think about overdressed here? I'm going to call her Elowen. Do you think it was a good idea to get her without her stock? I mean, I'm somebody that likes to make outfits. So um, just looking her over. Uh, do you think I should take her hair down or leave it up? Let me know in the comments and I will see you guys soon. Bye.